The Skinner Blend is a great way to blend two colors of polymer clay together. I'm Tammy Hahnemann and I can't wait to show you how well this technique works. I've conditioned two colors of clay, a red and a yellow. Can't get much more contrasting than that. Once my clay is fully conditioned, I've trimmed them to a square. I'll then take the super slicer and I'll take the squares and cut them on a diagonal. So I have two tri triangles of each color. I'll flip the triangles on top of each other so now the red and the yellow are of double thickness. To create a Skinner blend where the original colors still remain once you're done blending them, you want to offset your triangles and then trim it back up to square. And then as you blend that sheet, those two colors will remain. If you want to have your sheet fully blended, you just leave the triangles the way they are. Once you, once you have that completed, we'll take those two colors, put them into the poly roller on the thickest setting, which for the poly roller from Fire Mountain is number one. We're going to roll those two colors. And to continue to make sure you have this done correctly, you just want to fold that sheet in half so that the colors are on each other and not folding it the other direction because then you'll just have a nice blend <laughs> of a color you didn't mean to have. I'm putting the folded end back in first so that if I've trapped any air, it will come out as I roll it back through the pasta, poly roller or pasta machine. Again, I'll just fold it in half and I'll roll it through again. And once you've used this poly roller for polymer clay, you're going to want to just dedicate it to that process and not use it for food. I'm going to continue that 15 to 20 times or until you're happy with the blended sheet that you have. Mine looks like this. I've pre-made some Skinner blends for you. This black to white shows how you can gradate that colorway. And I've trimmed off a piece of it just and rolled it up just so you can see what it would look like in a simple cane. There are a lot of other color options you can choose from. You can blend your own colors as well and then blend those together. This is for your inspiration as well as the designs on the table. There are over 9,000 designs on the Fire Mountain website, which you can also draw from. Combining that with this new technique, you're going to have a wonderful time. Enjoy it.